September 2nd. On this day we keep the memory of the holy martyr Mamas. Saint Mamas came from Gangra in Paphlagonia in Asia Minor. His parents, named Theodotus and Rufina, were faithful Christians and they were confessors of the faith. They were cast into prison by the pagans for refusing to deny Christ, and Mamas saw the light of day in a prison cell in 260. Since both his parents died in prison, the little orphan was adopted by a pious woman called Amiana, or Matrona as some say. He became known as Mamas when he was a little child because this word for his foster mother was ever on his lips. Before her death, she warned him above all else to keep himself from idols. When he was 15, Mamas was seized by soldiers in Caesarea, the chief city of Cappadocia, for refusing to sacrifice and for persuading his companions not to do so. He was sent first to Democritus the governor and then brought before the emperor Aurelian himself. Seeing his tender ears, the tyrant thought to win the boy over with sweet flatteries, but soon discovered that Mamas' spirit was stronger than a diamond and a flame with divine zeal more than the most fiery furnace. The emperor was enraged to have a youth boldly hold his own against himself the master of the largest part of the world, and had him cruelly beaten. Imagining that he had broken Mamas' spirit, Aurelian said, No, simply say that you have sacrificed to the gods, and I will release you. Neither in my heart nor in my lips will I ever deny Christ my Saviour, Mamas replied. On the contrary, I thank you, Emperor, for these torments that enable me to love Christ more and to unite myself to my King who suffered for my salvation. Flaming torches were applied to his entire body. His limbs were battered with stones and he was cast into the sea with a leaden weight around his neck. But an angel of the Lord transported him to a high mountain overlooking the city. Glorifying God in ceaseless prayer, he lived there among the wild animals that offered him their milk for food. After some time, in the strength of a sign for God, Mamas went down the mountain and gave himself up to Alexander, the new governor of Cappadocia. He was once again put to the torture, which only availed to reveal in all its brilliance the grace of God in his soul and in his body. He was thrown into a fiery furnace, where he remained like the three Hebrew children, telling forth the glory of God and protected from the consuming flames by a dew from heaven. In the end, pierced through with a fork, Mamas found the strength to make his way out of the city, where he surrendered his soul to God. Then a voice was heard from on high, calling the martyr to rest from his labours in the eternal habitations of Christ's kingdom. Blessed is our God, always known from the age of the Lord. Amen. Glory to you, O God, glory to you. Heavenly King, the Comforter, the Spirit of Truth, who are ever and filling all things, treasury of blessings and giver of life, come and abide in us and cleanse us from every impurity, and save us all, O good one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal of mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal of mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, cleanse us from our sins. O Master, pardon our transgressions. O Holy One, visit and heal and affirm peace for your name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, 
hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Glory the kingdom of God, glory the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and contest for thee, received as the prize the crowns of incorruption and life from thee, our immortal God. For since he possessed thy strength, he cast down the tyrants and wholly destroyed the demon's strengthless presumption. O Christ God, by his prayer save our souls, since thou art merciful. The chariot of Pharaoh was sunk in olden times by Moses' rod, which wrought a mighty wonder when in the crosses from it struck the sea, dividing it in twain. And it led into safety, sojourning Israel that fled by foot, chanting to the Lord God a song of praise. Holy Martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. As thou goes about in the heavens as a triumphant martyr, filled with triply shining splendor, O glorious Mamas, vouchsafe divine enlightenment unto them that honor upon the earth the venerable and light-giving day of thy consummation. Holy Martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. For seeing the nobility and perfection of thy mind in all things, O Mamas, the word filled thee with understanding from thy swaddling clothes, and variously adorned thee with all kinds of beauty, O all a loaded martyr and prize winner. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. When Ada was waging persecution, thy parents cast themselves into peril for the sake of the blameless faith, and shut up in the prison where they were to end their lives for their longing after God. They brought forth thee who broke the bones of polytheism. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. From generation to generation, glorious things are spoken of thee, O Theotokos, Mary. For thou didst contain God, the Word, in thy womb, and didst remain pure, wherefore we all honor thee after God as our protection. Of the vault of the heavens art thou, O Lord Passioner, so unto of the church art thou founder, do thou establish me in unfeigned love for thee, who art the height of things sought for, and staff of the faithful, O only friend of man. O holy martyr Mama, pray to God for us. Christ has the athlete Mamas in the height of his church as a beaming star that makes the whole world shine with the rays of contest and marvellous miracles. Holy Martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. Ascending into the mount of true knowledge and flashing like lightning in divine visions because of thy purity of mind, O Martyr, thou didst arouse irrational nature unto rational praise by divine bidding. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thou was a fair and a right comely youth, and thou didst prove to be unapproachable to them that lawlessly sought to take thee, when, like the Lord of all, thou camest to thy passion of thine own will. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. He that stretched out the heaven and embraces the whole circle of the earth in the nature of his divinity, was boldly embraced in thine arms, and has shown thee forth as a support to all the faithful, O Immaculate Virgin. Thou, the venerable offspring of godliness, didst enfeeble the might of impiety, made strong with the spirit's strength, O famed me, Mama's much suffering saint. Thou didst censure the error of idols before all men, boldly preaching that God must be honored in Trinity. Hence, when thou wast given up to wild beasts, thou slewest that dragon and wicked beast which gave evil its origin. For this cause we cry out to thee, intercede with Christ our God, that forgiveness of all their transgressions be granted to them that with longing 
keep thy holy memory. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. By conceiving the wisdom and word of God in thy womb without being consumed thereby, thou bearest for all the world him that filleth the universe. Thou hast held in thine arms him that holdeth together all, he that fashioned creation and giveth the food to all. Wherefore I beseech thee, O thou all-holy Virgin and Mother of God, that I be redeemed from my many sins, when I shall have to stand before the face of my Creator and God. O pure Virgin Lady, help me in that hour, for thou canst do whatsoever thou dost will, O all hymned Thou art my strength, thou art my power and might, O Lord. Thou art my God, thou who hast not absent from thy Father's arms. Thou, Lord, art my joy. Thou hast deigned to visit our lowliness and our poverty. To thee, therefore, I cry out with Habakkuk the prophet. Glory be to thy power, O friend of man. O holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. Of thine own will, thou didst proceed unto conflict with the fearless mind, O glorious Mamas. For thou hast Christ working with thee, strengthening thy weakness with divine power, and making thee a martyr of his passion, and a partaker of the splendor on high. Holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. The wild beast sent from God is thy fellow wayfarer, obeyed thee like an altogether rational being, and a fellow laborer. For since thou hast made the irrational passion subject to divine order, thou wast shown to be comely by thy most wise mind, triumphing over the irrationality of enemies. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thou didst stand before the judges' tribunal, loudly proclaiming the incarnation of the Word. O blessed mamas, withering up the arrogance of ungodliness, and teaching all men to sing with undoubting faith. Glory to thy power, O friend of man. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. At the delivery of thy supernatural childbearing, loosed is the condemnation of pangs in travail, and the nature of the earth born is set free from all curse, O all blameless Mother of God. And through thee the things on high are opened unto those below, and mortals dance with angels. Wherefore hast thou deprived me and cast me the hapless one far from thy countenance? And the outer darkness has enshrouded and cast its gloom over me. Yet now I beseech thee, do thou convert me and direct me to the light of thy precepts, O Lord my God. O holy martyr, mamas, pray to God for us. The glorious mamas, when he was being scraped, took no thought for his body whatsoever, and casting off the grossness of corruption while he was being torn in pieces, he stripped off the coat of skin and received the garment of incorruption. Holy martyr, mamas, pray to God for us. Thou sangs a song of thanksgiving unto thy Creator, while thy sides were dug out, O all blessed one, and thou heard a voice from heaven, the more confirming thy mind in what is better, and lightening the distress of thy pain. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. While thou wast confined in prison, there appeared an exceedingly beautiful dove from heaven, bringing thee food of incorruption in a wondrous vision. O oh, much suffering, an all blessed athlete, for thou hadst surpassed the bonds of corruption. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Thou became the occasion of divine incarnation and inexpressible transformation, when thou didst conceive him that was begotten of the Father before the Son. For through thee the nature of mortals has been united unto God and is seated upon the throne of glory. O Lord, be gracious to me, for many are mine iniquities, and from the pit of my wicked deeds raise me up, I pray, for unto thee have I cried. O God of my salvation and my Saviour, hearken unto me. 
O holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. O flame with zeal for God, O sacred Mama, so did in no wise heed the fire kindled beneath thee. But thou hast be due to the divine reign from heaven, O valiant prize winner. Holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for he us. He that resplendently changed the furnace into dew for the three children, snatched thee from the flame and wondrously showed thee to be stronger than the fire, O all-blessed and godly-minded Mama. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Persevering in great struggle, as thou didst prove to be surpassing great, wondrous among athletes, and tried among martyrs. Therefore the setter of the contest deemed thee worthy of great recompense. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. We are become partakers of the divine nature because of thy childbirth, O Immaculate One. And we who with angelic orders laud thee have inherited the heavenly portion in Christ. With the staff bestowed on thee, by God, O holy great martyr, shepherd us, thy people, now in green and life-giving pastures, swiftly crush with godly power unseen and wild beasts, Underneath the feet of them that praise thee with longing, for in dangers we all have thee, O Mama says, our fervent protector and help. Let us praise Mamas, the martyr famous throughout all the earth, who dances in the heavens with the angels who marvelously drank the milk of does in the wilderness before time, and now as a shepherd tends well the Lord's own people with a scepter of power, and guides them into a place of verdure, wherein is verily the delight of paradise. Hence in dangers we all have thee, O Mama, as our fervent protector and help. Hence in dangers we all have thee, O Mama, as our fervent protector and help. Once in Babylon the fire stood in awe of the condescension of God, wherefore the youths dancing with joy step in the furnaces in a meadow chanted, Blessed art thou, o God of our fathers. O holy martyr, mamas, pray to God for us. The furnace served thee for a bedchamber, for thou wast shut up therein for many days, O blessed mamas. Yet was not burned while crying to thy maker, Blessed is the God of our Father. Holy martyr, mamas, pray to God for thou us. Thou didst obtain the angels as helpers, fellow choristers, and partners with thee in unspeakable songs amidst the flame, O martyr, with whom thou didst cry to the Master, Blessed is the God of our Father. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Most fair indeed art thou, coming out of the furnace like an unwithering rose, like a bridegroom from a bright chamber, scorching the foolish and enlightening them that look on as they cry, Blessed is the God of our Father. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Behold, fulfilled now is the prophecy of the God proclaimer, for thou didst conceive God the Word in thy womb, O Virgin, and gave birth to the giver of life, unto whom we all cry, Blessed is the God of our Father. The Chaldee tyrant, mad with rage, fired his furnace a blazing flame, seven times more hot against the worshippers of God. But seeing them kept in safety by a power greater than his, he then cried aloud, Ye children, bless the Creator. O ye priests, sing his praises, exalt him, O ye people, to all the endless ages. O holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. Like Daniel, thou didst muzzle the gaping mouth of beasts by the divine invocation of the Master, O glorious Mamas, 
thou slewest the serpent, thou didst cover the impious with shame, and as a victor thou dwellest in the heavens with gladness, as thou dost sing, bless him, O you priests, supremely exalt him, O you people, unto all the ages. Holy Mother, Mama, pray to God for us. The transgressors who worshipped stones and were hardened in soul, cast stones at thee, O blessed Mamas, who had the eye of thy sacred soul fixed on that rock which cannot be broken or brought low. And thou didst eagerly sing, Bless him, O you priests, supremely exalt him, O you people, unto all the ages. We bless Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, the Lord. The setter of the contest, holding out the crown to thee from above, as to a victor who had finished a good fight, told thee to set off upon that hallowed and most sweet road that leads on to him. O oh, all blessed one, thou didst eagerly sing, bless him, O you priests, supremely exalt him, O you people, unto all the ages. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Thou didst conceive past nature him that is motherless from the Father, and didst remain a virgin after childbirth, O immaculate lady. For God's union makes nature new in thee, and the boundaries of being are also made new. Therefore, in orthodox manner, we rightly proclaim thee as the Theotokos, who gave birth to God unto the ages. The heavens were astonished and stood in awe, and the ends of the earth made were sore amazed. For God appeared bodily to mankind as very man. And lo, thy womb is proved to be vaster and more spacious than heaven's heights. For this, O Theotokos, the choirs and assemblies of men and angels magnify thy name. O holy martyr, Mama, pray to God for us. Thou didst commit thy soul to the Redeemer, and didst eagerly ascend to him, notably adorned with the beauties of thy sacred struggles and marvellous wrestlings, O all laudable warrior, luminary of the whole world and adornment of the church. Holy Martyr, Mama, pray to God for thou us. Thou hast been united to the angels since thou had an angelic way of life upon the earth, and with them thou joyously sings a sacred song in the Trinity's praise, O Mamas, deified in uttermost renown through divine participation and reveling in glory and ending. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Since thou hast borne us with God, remember us who joyously celebrate thy divine festival, and load thy sacred and venerable contest with sincere faith, O all-blessed martyr and preserve us from tempest and perils and temptation. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. What man on earth has ever heard of a mother giving birth to a child without knowing a man? Or that he who is born is a beginningless God and is of one nature, both the everlasting and originate Father, and with her that supernaturally gave him birth? O strange mystery, O divine communion, whereby we are commingled with God. Upon the milk of toast thou wast fed and nourished, while living in the mountains, O martyr Mamas. Yet when thou didst strive in contest eagerly, thou didst show thy nobility. And winning prizes of victory, thou wintest hands to the Lord God. Wisdom, most holy mother of God, save us. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim, thee who without corruption gave us birth to God the Word. The very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. Glory to you, Christ God, O hope, glory to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Holy Father, bless. May Christ, O true God, the prayers of his holy and all pure mother, with the prayers of St. John the Baptist, of the holy and all praised apostles, with the power and under the protection of the holy life-giving cross and all the bodiless powers of heaven. At the prayers of our fathers among the saints in Ninian and Cuthbert, the bishops of God, Cisoes the Great, Brandon the Navigator, 
Oren of Iona, Columba of Iona, Kenneth, Ronan, Flannan, all the saints of all these islands, protectors of our monastery and our community. With the prayers of the holy martyr Mamas, the holy martyrs Theodotus and Rufina, his parents, and Saint Amia, his foster mother. With the prayers of our father among the saints John the Foster, patriarch of Constantinople. With the prayers of Saint Diomedes, who, having been beaten with the flat of a sword, was perfected in martyrdom. With the prayers of Saint Julian, who, his head being crushed with a stave, was perfected in martyrdom. With the prayers of Saint Philip, who was perfected in martyrdom by the sword. With the prayers of Saint Eutychian, who, burned upon a grill of fire, was perfected in martyrdom. With the prayers of Saint Hezekiah, who was perfected in martyrdom by hanging. With the prayers of Saint Leonides, who was perfected in martyrdom by fire. With the prayers of Saint Eutychius, who was perfected in martyrdom by crucifixion. With the prayers of Saint Philadelphus, who, his neck being weighed down with a stone, was perfected in martyrdom. With the prayers of Saint Melanippus, who was perfected in martyrdom by fire. With the prayers of Saint Parthagapi, who was perfected in martyrdom in the sea. With the prayers of the righteous priest Eleazar, the son of Aaron, and his son Phineas. With the prayers of the holy martyrs Athalus and Ammon. With the prayers of our Father among the saints Justus, Bishop of Lyon, Saint Hugh of Tarcaster, and Saint Lowland of Scotland, and those with them whose memory we also keep this day. And the prayers of the holy ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints, have mercy on us and save us. For he is good, and he loves mankind. Amen. And the prayers of our holy fathers, Lord Jesus Christ our God, have mercy upon us and save us. Amen.